Hey everyone, this is Mike from Mike's Do It Yourself. Today I want to show you how to do a toilet tank uh, repair. It's not really a repair, it's more of a preventative maintenance. And it's a brace that you're going to put behind there. And what it does, it keeps the toilet tank from hitting the wall. And so it'll prevent leaks in the future. So it may not happen over a shorter period of time, but over a longer period of time. You can get the seals in between the tank and the bowl where I'm showing you right here, it will uh, rock back and forth. The tank will rock back and forth and that will create a leak. And then also around the floor, you have a seal around the floor, a wax seal, and you have the ring that goes around there. And over time that can leak also, just from that rocking back and forth on the toilet. So the way these clips are installed the one side goes around the back there and you can put them you know there's two to a pack so you'll have one on the left one on the right and these clips will fit right on the edge of your tank and then this other plastic piece you can just cut a little bit beyond the edge of your tank and you can just measure this with your hand. So once you figure out where you want to cut, you can use an X-Acto knife, you can use a box cutter, some really good scissors, just something to go through this plastic. It's really thick plastic. So just use what you're able to use to cut through it. And if you cut it a little bit short, you can always trim off a little bit of this and stick it into the other piece and then once it's cut it'll just fit into that other piece there so you just fit the two pieces together and then you can put that Wherever it fits, it may not fit on the right, it could fit on the left. And you don't really want to push it so that it's not going to fit in there nicely. You just want to push it in there so it's snug. Go ahead and do the same thing for the other side. You just measure it with your hand. And then once you get it cut most of the way through, you can snap it. And then it should slide in and you can move them around a little bit depending on how how well they fit on one side or the other you just make sure it's tight around there once you get both sides in and that'll keep it from rocking back and forth and then it'll keep those screws down there from leaking after time and then that ring around between the tank and the bowl it'll keep that from leaking well I hope this has been helpful this has been Mike from Mike's Do It Yourself good luck on your next home or automotive project and thanks for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe